Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around on this fully loaded 2012 Tiffin Phaeton 42 LH quad slide bath and a half diesel pusher motorhome. Go ahead and get started on the inside and then finish up by showing you the outside. Overall exterior length is 42 feet, six inches. Exterior height to the triple low profile AC units is 12 feet, seven inches. This coach is equipped with the 400 horsepower Cummins 8.9 liter turbo diesel engine, and it does have 1,250 foot pounds of torque. Kind of give you an idea of the floor plan here. All right. Okay, start off in the living room slide out. The first slide out is definitely going to be a super slide. Uh, about, uh, oh gosh, uh, 18 foot long. And it accommodates the entertainment center. Not sure what size they're calling that huge flat screen TV. Maybe a 55 inch for 2012. That was pretty pretty big size. Uh, and also the fireplace. It's about a 4800 uh, BTU heating source on the fireplace. Your recliner. All the fabrics, uh, the furniture in this whole coach and the co-pilot and pilot seat were all upgraded. The owner did not like what came with the coach originally, so these are all upgraded uh, furniture by Tiffin. He took the Red Bay, Alabama, and swapped out the Euro recliner and the L Lounge, which I'll show you here in a second. And also in the first slide out's gonna be the freestanding table and chairs. This table does pull out. Let's pull that out, I'm one-handed. There you go, and there are two chairs, I believe, somewhere around here. If I see them, and then uh, I'll try to show them in the video. Uh, the chairs uh, at the dinette uh, table here looks like showing a little bit of maybe wear and tear, uh, just a little cushioning weakness right there. But anyway, I may be wrong. I'm real picky. Colors on the fabrics are going to be the light tans and uh, some other colors. I'm colorblind, so anyway, I do want to point out. Uh, the window shades and the wi window treatments. Tiffin's going to offer some of the best window treatments and cabinetry work, hands down, in the RV industry. Uh, the cabinets are definitely some of the best built. Uh, when I was Tiffin certified, they basically make us hang from the cabinets at the factory plant, at the plant, and yeah, I'm not going to do it on this coach because it's not my coach. So, anyway, also in the super slide is going to be the upgraded uh, residential refrigerator. This coach is equipped with a 2,000 watt inverter to power the refrigerator when you're going down the road. Show off that ice maker too. Stainless steel finish. Coach is a little dirty. I'm real picky when I do my walk arounds. Uh, look, look, a little tape. A little goof off. Take some of that off. But anyway. All right. Second slide out, it's going to accommodate the kitchen and the L sofa, sleeper sofa that I'll show you. Uh, kitchen kitchen area here, let's, uh, let's point out a little pantry here. That's where your oven would have been, but since you have a convection oven, you don't really need an oven, so nice convection oven. Uh, three burner gas cooktop, front burner is usually a high output. Corning countertops, solid surface Corning style countertops all throughout. Uh, the countertops and everything backsplash are going to be some of the finest you're going to find in a coach. There's that Tiffin badge right there. Nice extension right here and it just closes away and locks huge extended ball bearing drawer guides uh, the hardware is going to be a brush nickel let's pan in on that for a second all right speed this video up a little bit there's a ton of stuff on this coach l lounge sofa upgraded excellent condition uh your recliner fabrics are in excellent condition kind of show that off there i do want to point out when the slides are in this l lounge breaks down pretty easy this all breaks down Kind of pan in on that directions on how that goes cushion goes down this slides in pretty neat concept let's 
Let's put that back for the video purpose. All right. Fantastic vent fan, soft touch vinyl ceiling, ducted AC, as I pointed out. Uh, three low profile AC units with heat pumps. Your floor is going to be a ceramic floor with a porcelain flash or a porcelain finish. Definitely some of the best uh, flooring you're going to get on a coach. I do want to point out a little puck light missing right there. We're talking about a dollar piece. I told the owners they'll probably get that taken care of. To have the porcelain tile in the bedroom, that was an option. I do know that. A fat standard was carpet. So this coach is fully loaded for a Phaeton 42LH. King bed, this is going to be your third slide out. King bed lifts up. There's storage up underneath. And I believe that's a... a air mattress it fully adjusts it's one of the best mattresses you're going to find ceiling fan and show off the ultra leather finish and wood headboard i believe that was an option too let me paint around here this coach also in case i forget has central vac there's your fourth slide out it's going to be your second tv uh, solid surface, coin countertops, all throughout. All right, this is going to be the master bath. I forgot to show the half bath. I'll show that when I'm walking forward. Huge rear master bath. Nice wood pocket door there for privacy. Kind of back up here, show off the stackable washer and dryer that was an option not sure what they're calling the cabinets I always say a glazed maple but uh, anyway if I find out definitely what the cabinets are I'll note that in the description fantastic vent fan and again Corian countertops solid surface countertops and there's that Tiffin logo right there all tile backsplash all throughout this coach huge closet right there foot flush porcelain toilet as I said the coach it needs a little detail uh, there's a little rain droplet stuff like that I, uh, I'm just real picky when I do my walk arounds but it could use a little cleaning nice little detailing all right you get the idea Thermostat controls, easy to figure out. Uh, this is going to be driver, passenger, slide buttons right there for the bedroom slides. Oh, another pocket door, which is convenient. 110 outlets on each side of the bed. If you have a sleep at machine, you're all taken care of on that. Kind of show off. Uh, from the rear to the front in the living area. It's going to be the half bath that I forgot to point out. Great floor plan. Uh, this floor plan is going to be the longest uh, that they offered in 2012. Another fantastic vent fan. All right. As I said, this coach has got a ton of stuff, so let me speed up this video a little bit. Okay, the co-pilot pilot seat. These are the seats that they actually put in an Allegro bus. The owner was at Red Bay. They did not have the ones that he was wanting to order, so they, anyway, installed these. These are Allegro bus seats for 2012. So this coach is actually one of a kind. Six-way power on the co-pilot and I believe eight-way power and I may be wrong on that I forgot to tell check out what Allegro bus offers on their co-pilot seat But I do believe this is eight-way pilot seat All right Cockpit here. This is going to be your HWUH leveling one of your leveling jacks are brand new and Kind of pan in on the buttons right here uh, it's going to be your ICC flasher. That's uh, when you see the truckers flash their lights after you another truck uh, flashes in front or drives in front of them. They change lanes. That's this kind of a thank you flasher. That's what I call it. Uh, air horn, air brakes, air ride, all the good stuff that you want on a diesel pusher. This is going to be your tag dump for lowering it down. Two stage engine brake so you don't wear out your brakes. 
six speed Allison 3000 transmission best that they make uh, full adjusting pedals gas uh, um, I'm sorry uh, diesel pedal and the uh, brakes full adjusting and this is your auxiliary start button and this one's gonna be your engine preheat air brake all the good stuff heated chrome side mirrors let me real quick just point out the mileage on this see if it comes up Okay. Let's see if we can go back there. There it is. 29,275 miles on the coach currently. It's going to be your color backup monitor and the cameras are tied into this, the side view cameras. So you got the full camera package on this. This is going to be your GPS stereo also by JVC. Pin in on these buttons down here uh, to the left. Step cover. Step cover does come out and uh, that step cover right there and let's see here driver's fan and uh, the solar shade I've got that down right now okay uh, the night shade uh, that's the blackout uh, windshield shade the owner says that the motor is broken on it uh, you're talking about a $200 part it's a non-issue generator start and stop button map light button docking lights and radio and temperature controls TV up here that's your third TV up here is going to be your energy management system this is going to be your uh, more slide buttons for the living room awning button this is going to be your wine guard in motion satellite fully loaded uh, this is going to be your monitor panels for your holding tanks and LP tank which is 36 gallon uh, water heater this is a tankless water heater and these are more awning controls all right let's speed this up Turn off the generator. Generator start and stop. Generator's at 10,000 ONAM. Back up here, show off that full body paint. Paint job on this coach is going to be the best in the industry. Uh, Tiffin has definitely the best paint process. And I do want to point out uh, the front headlights are showing a little bit of uh, that fogging. I don't know if you can detail them up. I'm sure you can. Uh, this is going to be your pull-out, manual pull-out, 10K Onan diesel generator. Push that back in. Lock it. I'm one-handed. All right. Can't do it. I'm one-handed. But anyway, a little scratch right here from the windshield wiper. It was raining real bad when they were coming back from somewhere, and for some reason the window away anyway. anyway Non-issue. Might be able to be able to be buffed out this is the little chip on the windshield I'm rating this coach in good condition and uh, but anyway I told the owner he might be able to get uh, some kind of window doctor to come out and and fill that in show off that front there fiberglass roof full walk-on fiberglass roof triple AC units full awning package door awning package and your awning here the main awning it might be a weather Pro awning where basically it will go in when the wind gets too high. All the fabrics on the awnings are all in excellent condition. I forgot to put this TV out. Uh, 32 inch, I believe, flat screen TV that's right there. My bad. Uh, oh, the tires uh, pretty much are all excellent. Uh, well, they are pretty, pretty much excellent. Uh, the front ones are the year 2017. He just installed them two years ago. He says, the owner says this coach had, that these tires here on the fronts have just under 2,000 miles on them. Uh, so they're, they're excellent condition and uh, they're like brand new. 22 inch aluminum alcohol wheels for sitting on a Freightliner chassis. There's your, one of your fuel fills there. Another one on the other side, 36 gallon LP tank. Side opening baggage doors, by the way. Best you're gonna get. Pull out slide tray, I believe it rated at least 200 pounds. Slam latch baggage doors. Gotta love them. Gotta love them. Side hinged. More storage. Raised rail chassis, of course. It's a no brainer. There's your central vac, Dirt Devil. Kind of show off. I didn't see any nicks in the paint at all. There's a gravity fill right there. Your freshwater holding tank. This tire on the front and on the other side, they're matching. 2017s. Now the rear, the tag, 
These were manufactured in 2019. I'll show you on the back side. I can't see the manufacturing date on this. These were just installed. They have the 10 miles on them. And there are Michelin's, the good ones. Michelin's, let me see if I can get the logo. Hey, I'll do it on the back side. But uh, there's your uh, fuel emissions, um, fuel basically, uh, your, your DEF, D E F, uh, fuel reservoir, and servicing for electronics, easy to do right there. Let's show off that side. Beautiful paint job. Nice ladder, get on your full walk on roof, 400 Cummins, 8.9 liter turbo diesel engine, 10K hitch, receiver on the back of this. You do have a nice mud flap, it says Phaeton on it. More storage. Two chassis batteries for your starting the engine, battery disconnect. And let me see if I can show the manufacturing date on this. There it is, right there. If you can see it, 29, 29th week of 2019. These rears on the tag are brand new. 22 inch aluminum alcoil wheels look real sharp. There's that Michelin badge right there. Michelin X, best tires you can get on a diesel coach. Okay, this is your water hookups, docking station. It's all heated. Four seasons coach, dual pane windows, all the good stuff, water filtration. 50 amp service. Uh, let's see here. I don't want to miss anything. More storage. That's that pull out tray. I'm doing that one handed. Yeah. I'm doing good. I'm getting ahead of myself. There's your four house batteries. And it's tied into your parallel together and tied into your, uh, your 2000 watt inverter. Nice pull out tray. Show off that back there. Good looking coach. Again, tires on the front here, 2017s. Another fuel fill right there. Chrome heated side mirrors. Little thing missing right here. Notice that? Non issue. Told the owner he might be getting the part, but beautiful coach. All right, I know I didn't get everything, but. If you want to come and see the coach, just call the number. You deal directly with the owner. And if you like this video, appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up on YouTube. And if you want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale by owner in the Louisville, Kentucky area, you can always follow helpsellmyrv.com on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and YouTube.